we are here with more case image animatronics. Now, uh, they recently had an update where uh, they added in more checkpoints. Uh, the flashlight is no longer flickering. I always thought that was part of the game, but I guess not. But yeah, it's working now. And uh, they no longer check hiding spots. Uh, like the obvious ones, like under tables. Well, they check them, but not as much anymore. Which is good. Oh. It's a coming in. Was coming back in. Okay. I do wish you could crouch in this game, though. Oh, hell no. I do hear you out there. I'm dead. Wait, what? Jesus. Oh no. Why? And I guess that they added a sprint limitation. Because that wasn't there before. It's weird. Because the thing that sucks is when they start chasing, they don't stop chasing for a while. They should probably add unlimited sprint or something. No. Gone. 
this is actually pretty difficult though with two of them especially. See now, right about now is where I should be having full battery. Why? Why do you gotta do this to me? Oh, now it's gone. It is not. Mm -mm. <laughs> yeah, I had to take my headphones off for that one. Their screams are very loud, though. This has actually gotten uh, a little more difficult, it seems. Because I don't really remember the... I really don't remember uh, the two of them being that difficult. Because I... Because I was actually able to make it out of this room and into the other room last time I played. With no problem. That might have been one of the other updates that they just didn't mention, I guess, in the Steam community. Oh. You are shitting on me right now, aren't you? I'm just... There we go. Turn around. What? It's in there, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> Jesus! Oh. Oh. How is that fair? How is that fair? I just spawned and it came in the room. Th yeah, there are still some improvements I could see them doing. Especially like where you just spawn in and the animatronics come in and uh, spot you right away. And also like another thing that they should probably add in is like uh, if you can't get to a hiding a certain interactable hiding spot instantly even though you can't crouch I mean they could pro ho probably add that too but they could at least uh, 
add in an, uh, a feature where you could just stand in a in a dark room or standing in in a dark corner, and they wouldn't be able to see you. I don't know. That's just me. Because I mean, them alone chasing you is challenging enough. I don't know. It's there are still some uh, improvements they can make on this game. It's fun. Oh. I'm taking my headphones off again. <laughs> Walks away. Yeah, I I don't know like uh, uh with the uh oh shoot wait what oh there we go <clears throat> but yeah the uh improvements are the big one well they're big ones for me oh you. There. There we go. I mean, like this right here. This is this is a good improvement because before, when I would when they would see me and they were way back there and I would start hiding, that is when they would find me instantly. But now they just walk away, which is good. So. I'm going to take my headphones off because I'm not sure if it's going to catch me or not, but... It's not walking away. There we go. Alright. Yeah, as I was saying, the improvements. Uh, two improvements I could see them hopefully doing. Uh, the ability to crouch and uh, the ability to uh, hide in like a dark room or like a dark corner because sometimes there is actually uh, some points in the game or uh, times in the game where you are not able to get in <coughs> excuse me get to a oh my god uh, into an interactable hiding spot because uh, I mean and they are bastards to get away from so I don't know Mm. And I was gonna say maybe like add the ability to like vault over over like desks or something to evade them uh, quicker, um, and probably also add the ability to uh, strafe while running. I don't know, but that's more that's more than just two improvements. But uh, you know I don't really see this uh, this part to the game going anywhere because I don't know. Because uh, last time I played it, there was uh, I was actually able to get to the other room no problem, but now they it seems like that they're patrol that they're uh, patrolling the hallways a little more often, so it makes it a little uh, excessive, or that's a little excessive, and it makes it a little too more uh, too much of uh, a challenge. I like a I like a good challenge, but I don't know. I I just I'm finding it very difficult to try to get to the next room that I'm supposed to be uh, going into. Because, I mean, this is actually uh, the most F that the animatronics have patrolled. Because never before have they been uh, patro patrolling the hallways or rooms this much. So, uh, the first update was good, but there, like I said, and I'll say it again, there are some more improvements they could uh, do. But yeah, I don't really see this part going anywhere. It's uh, still... It's, a, it's still a relatively new game. I mean, it, it's it's uh, it's understandable, um, but we've only been streaming for 14 minutes, and that's trying to get to the other room. But it's so difficult where they're patrolling as uh, more often. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you want to join the Undead Horde, just hit that sub button, as well as check out my friends' uh, social media, gaming media, and. Uh, 
hopefully I will uh, see some improvements to this game uh, eventually. Uh, in the meantime, I might just move on to a different game. Uh, so probably like Leith or Layers of Fear or Soma or... <clears throat> what other games do I got? Or... Uh, <clears throat> I don't know, I'll think of something. But uh but yeah, I'm gonna wait I'm gonna wait on this game. It's like I said, it's fun, but there are still some improvements and uh yeah, play other games and stream them in the in the meantime until they make improvements. Alright. Catch you guys later.